Hello, Dave Hurwitz at ClassicsToday.com here with what is, for my money, the very best single disc of Beethoven sonatas for beginners that you could really get. This one. Ivan Moravets plays the Appassionata, the Patatique, the Moonlight, and, as an extra special bonus, Les Adieux, the Farewell. You know, Moravets was not the best known pianist on the block. Um, he passed away fairly recently, a couple of years ago. Uh, you know, he was one of those pianists who flies under the radar. He actually made quite a few recordings, but he had a limited repertoire and he was very, very, very particular about how, when, and where he would play and record. As a result of that, he never had a major label contract and he never had really decent management that would allow him to have a concert career in the West anyway, that would have given him the acclaim that he deserved. He was a pupil of, of Walter Gieseking, or at least a great admirer of Walter Gieseking as well. And that meant that he put great emphasis on quality of tone. That means quality of tone of his pianos and also the quality of his own touch and articulation. There wasn't anybody in the business who had the same sense of timbre and tone when playing the piano. Now, this could work for him and against him sometimes. I, he, he, once, he once told me a wonderful story about how he was in Steinway Hall and he had a favorite piano that he enjoyed using, but at one point he went back and it had been you know, tuned and regulated, and he found that, that all the quality of tone that he loved had vanished completely, and so he had to find a different piano. He used to travel with a, with a piano tuning kit um, with him just in case he needed to make some adjustments before the concert. He was also an extremely humble and, and modest person. So, you know, for all of his artistic integrity, his obsessiveness artistically, he was he was almost almost shy in his in his own his own manner, which meant, of course, that that wasn't exactly a way to build a huge career either. But he did record most of his basic repertoire. He was a specialist in French music, and he played a few select Beethoven sonatas as well or better than anyone ever has. I mean, this particular disc, which is I this is the VAI version. Some of these things have been recoupled and reissued on Superphone and in various guises. You may have to look around for them. But, you know, the fact that he emphasized touch in no way minimizes his ability to realize the music's drama. In, in the Patetique Sonata, for example, the outer movements have all the turbulence that you could ask for, but the central andante, my God, how beautiful, or the Moonlight Sonata. You know, you've never heard more beautiful moonlight but the finale is an absolute whirlwind. You know, the Appassionata Sonata has has all of that early romantic, you know, you know, struggle and and emotion and intensity. And and in Les Adieux, in the farewell, the finale is is an absolute apotheosis of a joyful reunion. I mean, Moravets could do all of this, but he did it. He did it through through the fingers, through the hands, through the touch. And it was kind of fascinating because he had hands, a friend, of, a friend of mine has once said, he had hands like a butcher. I mean, he, was, he had these sort of pudgy, short, stumpy fingers. You would never believe that he could create such a beautiful sound from his instrument. But he cared about his instruments and he also cared about his engineering and recordings. These recordings, the recordings on this disc date from between 1962 and 70, but they're all magnificent sonically and very consistent from one work to the next. You know, he had very, very definite ideas. He was simply an artist who cared. He cared about everything he did. And so if you're looking for an absolutely superb single disc set of the most popular Beethoven sonatas, once again, Ivan Moravets on VAI, you just can't beat it. Keep on listening, folks. Thank you.